Thanks. Welcome back to the show. So uh, good to be. Back. I want to talk about Barbarian, but I, I have lots of things to talk to you about. First of all, I saw you yesterday with Drew Barrymore. Yes. On her show. Yeah. And I thought that was fantastic. It was so nice to see her. It was so good to. Um, it was wild to do that in front of. You know, to reconnect <laughs> strangers of America on TV. I mean, watch, yeah, you met an unbelievable another celebrity backstage. Yes. This is why I was laughing when we were playing this game because <laughs> yeah. your last one, uh, you met you met the the corn yeah, master no of deal, South Dakota, guys. Tariq. He was so yes. That, this kid is unbelievable. Yeah, he was so cute. Obviously, oh, big surprise. He was cute. Yeah, big he surprise. A, he really he was, was cute. Yeah, uh, it wasn't a, it wasn't an act. But he, I said to him because obviously he loves. We all know he loves corn. I, but I said, uh, what, what are the, some of the things you, you don't really like? What, what are you not crazy about? <gasps> This is an exclusive? This is a big scoop, guys. So This is going to be all over just Jared. Yeah, yeah, so I can, I can report that Tariq does not like um, strawberries or peaches uh, or, sorry to say, Sonic the Hedgehog 2, but he loves Alvin and the Chipmunks. <laughs> so he prefers a chipmunk <laughs> to a hedgehog. Didn't appreciate the sorry to Ben Schwartz and everyone in <laughs> Sonic the Hedgehog. But he was, uh, yeah. I wanted to ask you why, why I had you, because I know you're, you're a great actor, but you're also very good at doing impressions. Oh. Uh, we've always done them to each other we backstage. Have, yeah. We always... yeah, people love it. People around us are I hope not at all annoyed it. by our No, <laughs> constant... not at all. But here's you. This is in, uh, this is in Walk Hard, the oh. Dewey Cox story. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, and you were, you were George Harrison. Oh, man. It was a thrill. And what a th Paul Rudd, Jason Paul Rudd, Schwartzman, Schwartzman, Jack Black. Jack Black. And the great... And John C. Riley. I mean, these are all my favorite, not myself, uh, all my, some of my, fa my favorite uh, performers. And yeah. So I got this Were call. you nervous to play with the Beatles? I, I was because it was, um, you know, the stakes couldn't be higher. It's the, it's the Beatles. Like, uh, if, if you like music, you love the Beatles. And I, I grew up listening. You know, we both, yeah. everyone loves the Beatles. I don't have to make that point. Um, and, uh, so but I got. So Judd called you? Judd and said, called and said, um, I want you to play George Harrison. And, and I, I, of course, said yes. And um, we had a day to prepare. And so I called Paul Rudd, who. Um, it's a very name droppy story, but you mentioned them also. P Paul was playing John Lennon, and, and I said, Paul, um, you know, I'm nervous. We're playing the Beatles, and he's like, dude, I'm nervous too. I know, we only have a day. And so I went over to his, his hotel room, and we just watched as much footage as we could of, of the Beatles and interviews and stuff. And, and while we were there, um, Jason Schwartzman called. He was playing Ringo, and he said, dude, I'm so nervous. Are you guys <laughs> nervous? And so the three of us were, uh, you know, sharing our nerves with each other. And, and um, as we were watching them, I, I, I never really realized how distinct they all were. I mean, you, you do such a great but there, impression. But how does Paul, Paul Well, go? Paul, Paul's very, you know, with him, it's, I, I, I like to, like, hook into something. Like, if it's a word or if it's a, just sort of a look. And he's, he's got his eyebrow, you know, is always kind of, like, up, up like this. And, it's, and he's very sing-songy, you know. And he says, you know, a lot, you know, up, up and down. Yeah, and it's you funny. know, yeah. yeah you know, it's, it's sort of like this. And, and we're the Beatles, with you the know. the Beatles and yeah. we're doing this. And, That's good. And then, and then John is, there's something kind of nasally about John. You know, John was very... You know, there's, it's, it's all kind of directed through the nose there. Yeah, very nasally, very speaking nasally. only through his nose. Sort of like that, yes. And, and Ringo, you have to, it's the least flat, the most unflattering. You kind of have to put your head back like this, and Ringo's <laughs> kind of back like this. But I thought, George, what is George's hook? And, and I realized it was just, um, he's just, he, he's just so, so com contemplative, you know. I mean, everything is sort of like this. And, and of course, I was sad when John died, but it was, um, you know, I knew, I knew, I was sad because I never played guitar with him again. Wow, but, but wow. we played guitar. Wow, and, you know, was, yeah. that is good. Yeah, good, yeah. You all the Beatles. Uh, uh, well, but so then we were like, so at the end of this, at the end of this, you know, uh, session with Paul, um, I'm, I'm leaving Paul Rudd, I'm leaving his hotel room, and, and uh, he said, you know, I shouldn't tell you. I said, I wonder how Jack Black's feeling. You know, because Jack's got to play Paul McCartney. And, and uh, Paul said, I, I shouldn't tell you this, but I ran into Jack the other day, and I asked him that. I said, dude, aren't you, aren't you nervous? We're playing the Beatles. And, and he said, nah, dude, I got it. It's in the bag. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, and Paul goes, how'd you do? He goes, dude, just watch Hard Day's Night. You go, That's all you got to do is watch Hard Day's Night. So we were like, oh. Dude, you know, dude, 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 it's in the bag. Dude, it's in the bag. Dude, I got it, dude. Uh, <laughs> got it, dude. And, uh, and, and so we were like, oh, Jack's going to blow us all out of yeah, the water. Of you know? And so we, sh we show up on set, and Jack's got the first line in rehearsal, and he goes, he's got the outfit on, he's, he's doing the eyebrows, you know, he's got that kind yeah. of going. And he goes, yeah, he's right here, and he goes, I ain't Paul McCartney, eh? <laughs> Like full on Scottish. And I looked at Rudd, and we're like, what's going on? And, and, and uh, but. But the lesson that we learned, which, which we sh shouldn't have needed to learn, is that Jack still stole the show because he's 
Jack Black. He's the <laughs> yeah. greatest of all time. Yeah, of course, yeah. And, don't you know, worry, he, don't overthink it. Yes, exactly. We were overthinking it. And he was just, he's like, everyone knows I'm not Paul McCartney. Yeah. I'm Jack Black. And I, it was so funny. It was so good. He was, he was brilliant. <laughs> I he, love Jack Black. I love Jack Black. Black. Yeah. Everyone loves Jack Black. He could do that. Uh, Let's talk about the, uh, you're in the number one movie right now in the Crazy. country, Barbarian. Uh, congratulations on this. Thanks. Uh, frightening. Uh, oh, it's so fun. It's fun. Scary movies getting great reviews. Uh, how did you feel when you found out it was the number one movie in the country? It was exciting. I got a text. I was in my place, um, which you've been to up in Massachusetts. Uh, I, live yeah. on a, I live in kind of a rural area up there, and um, all of my neighbors are over 70. And I got this text from the director, Zach Kreger, who's brilliant, and he said, hey, you're, we're in, we got the number one movie. And I said, I, said, I said it to them. I was proud. I had a moment where I said, hey, you guys, I'm, I, I'm in the number, number one movie. And they said, oh, oh, yeah, what's it called? I said, it's Bar Barbarian. And, and, and they said, oh, OK. And one of them said, hey, by the way, well, why aren't you ever uh, watering your garden? And I said, <laughs> Uh, what do you mean? He goes, you're never here. You're never here. Good, and Mick's having to water your garden. They could care less. Care less. They could care less I, about this yeah. movie. And I said, well, I've been promoting this movie. He goes, promoting? What do you, what do you have to do that for? Just, you got to water the garden. And, um, <laughs> and as I was leaving, I said to Mick, I said, so are you going to go see Barbarian? He goes, oh, yeah, I'm going to go to the local multiplex. The joke being there's no movie theater anywhere <laughs> near where I live. So they're not going to watch they're it. They're not going to watch it. But that's a good humble pie there for yeah, it. It was. It was like, uh, it was relative. Uh, I, I love uh, Zach Kreger, by the way. Way. He's great. He wrote and directed this. Yes. Yeah. Oh, he's, he's talented. Why does because you know he, the sketch comedy group? Talented really guy. Really brilliant. Um, but it's frightening. This it movie. is. It's it's scary. It's wild. And there's some turns. And it's one of those movies that we're supposed to be talking about it, but we're not supposed to say anything about it. So it's it's a little challenging. Yeah. Well, that, I guess know. that's the fun part of these scary movies because you go like, well, don't spoil it because yeah. every single thing could be a possibly a spoiler. Totally. Yeah. And 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 it is. It really is. Uh, the twists and turns are. are Wild. Well, we fun. could say someone moves into a, rents a house. No, no, don't say no. I, yeah, we can say sorry, sorry. We, say uh, we can say there are people in it. Okay. Uh, no, no. Yeah, someone rents a house. Someone rents, someone an, rents Airbnb, a house. Uh, an Airbnb. An Airbnb. Yeah, someone, Airbnb. That, that'll sell it. Someone rents a house. Air, yeah, that's a great story. And that, and, uh, someone rents an Airbnb. No, sorry, Jim. Wait, sorry. No, <laughs> they, they rent a house and, and it gets double booked. So Bill Skarsgård and Georgina Campbell, who are so good, they uh, they they find themselves together in this, in, in, not in an Airbnb. No. Not a scare Ooh. Ooh, yes. Is, yes. Is there anything you learned from making this film for the future or anything that you're like, oh? I, I would just say I love Airbnb. It's a great company. They do a lot of great work with, uh, yeah, 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 you know, yes, sure, yes, sure, but, yeah, yeah. But, but I would say um, check the basement. That would, that's, that's what I'm going to do for now. Wink. Yeah. That's check all you got to say right there. That the is the best way you could ever sell this movie. Yeah. I want to show everyone a clip. Here's Justin Long in Barbarian. Take a look at this. Hello? I like to let my baby determine how long he likes to nurse. Oh, God. It's Goldie performs for us after the break. Stick around, everybody. Hey, hey.